Former Good Morning Britain presenter Piers Morgan has shared his thoughts on reports an unnamed BBC presenter has been accused of paying a teenager money for sexually explicit images. Piers Morgan has said the BBC presenter claims will be a scandal that will rock Britain. It comes after a presenter is said to be facing an investigation after allegedly paying a teen for sexually explicit images, with sources claiming a top star has been accused of handing over £35,000. The mother of the alleged person behind the camera, who was just 17 at the time, claims the teen had used the extortionate amount of cash to fund a crack cocaine addiction. Radio 2 presenter Jeremy Vine and former Strictly It Takes Two co-host Rylan Clark both took to their respective Twitter accounts on Saturday to deny being the mystery presenter. In response to the claims, broadcaster Piers Morgan took to Twitter to share his own thoughts on the allegations. He wrote, This is a huge scoop and a massive scandal that will rock Britain. In his tweet, Piers attached an image of the Sun newspaper's front page splash reporting the claims. Piers currently hosts a show on Talk TV and has a column in The Sun, both companies owned by media mogul Rupert Murdoch. The well-known presenter is said to not be on air in the next few days according to the BBC, with the corporation understood to be looking into the claims. One time he had sent £5,000 in one lump. The money had been in exchange for sexually explicit photographs of my child, the mother told The Sun. It's believed that the family of the concerned recipient approached the BBC on May 19 and claimed she pleaded with the broadcaster to beg the man to stop sending cash. The messages are said to have started in 2020 and the man behind sending the images refrained from protecting his identity, as well as allegedly sending images of himself at his place of work. A spokesperson for the BBC told The Mirror, We treat any allegations very seriously and we have processes in place to proactively deal with them. As part of that, if we receive information that requires further investigation or examination we will take steps to do this. That includes actively attempting to speak to those who have contacted us in order to seek further detail and understanding of the situation. If we get no reply to our attempts or receive no further contact that can limit our ability to progress things but it does not mean our inquiries stop. If, at any point, new information comes to light or is provided, including via newspapers, this will be acted upon appropriately, in line with internal processes. Amid online speculation regarding the identity of the presenter, Jeremy Vine and Ryland Clark have both quickly shut down any claims it is either of them. Ryland told his Twitter followers this morning, Not sure why my name's floating about but re that story in the sun, that ain't me babe. I'm currently filming a show in Italy for the BBC, so take my name out your mouths. Jeremy shared a similar statement this afternoon, tweeting, Just to say I'm very much looking forward to hosting my radio show on Monday. Whoever the BBC presenter in the news is, I have the same message for you as Ryland did earlier, it certainly ain't me.